Hey everyone, welcome back to Crown Geek. In this video, I will be explaining that how to fix non-authenticated with Minecraft.net fail to connect to the server. So if you're getting this message while launching your Minecraft launcher, then apply the solution that I'm going to share in this video. But make sure that you apply all the solution one by one and whichever work for you let me know in the comment section and even subscribe to the channel and like the video if this works for you the first thing that you have to do is you need to uh, power recycle your router this is very easy what you have to do simply unplug your router from the computer and from the uh, power switch so simply go and remove the plug from the power switch and after that also remove from your PC or your laptop if it's connected with the Ethernet and wait for 5 to 10 seconds and after that you can plug in back again and wait until your internet comes back. Once the internet comes back you need to come to this website the link will be in the description and here you need to check your internet speed. If your speed is poor fluctuating or high ping then you may get this Minecraft uh, not authenticated with minecraft.net issues so right now on my end you can see i'm getting the stable uh, downloading speed of 50 mbps even the ping is good the connection is stable so everything is fine from my end but you also need to assure that the same result is on your end or better if you are getting the poor internet connection then you can contact your internet service provider so once you are done with this in the next step we need to apply a few a uh, command that will be scanning our system file and the DNS so that it can fix any problem with the system or DNS. On the Windows search, you have to type CMD and choose run as administrator. And the black window will be coming up. Type here SFC space forward slash scan now. Hit enter. Now this will be scanning all the system file and this will be taking some time because uh, it verify all the system file of your windows. So what we can do we can minimize it and proceed with the other commands. Again click on the search box type CMD and choose run as administrator. Another black window will be coming up. The first command that you need to type here will be IP config space forward slash flush DNS. Hit enter and the flush the will be successfully done here. The next command will be NETSH win sock reset. Hit enter again and this will say to restart the computer but we have to do a few more steps and after that you can restart. So you can minimize it and if we check the SFC scan so it's, it's still running so we have to wait until it's been 100% completed. And meanwhile, what you can do, you can quit your Minecraft launcher. So you have to bring your task manager on Windows 10. Make a right click on the taskbar and choose task manager. Here you will find Minecraft launcher. Just make a right click on it and choose end task. Once done, you can, you can see that the verification is completed now for the SFC scan. It says uh, Windows resource protection did not file any integrity violation so in my end everything is good to go but probably on your end there should be some integrity violation and this will automatically fix it and you have to check the message if there are any indications any suggestion you need to follow it once you have done now you can finally make a restart and check back that if this fix the problem and if not then do not need to worry i have a couple of more solutions in the next step just open your file explorer and once it comes up click on this pc then on local disk c then on windows and then you have to look for system 32 so keep a scroll and here you'll find system 32 just double click on it then you have to look for drivers here it is double click on drivers and then on etc double click on etc and now here you will find a file that contains a name host it can be imhost.sam or probably it can be only host so you have to look for it double click on it if it asks you how do you want to open the app then you can choose application of notepad i have already selected so it will directly open with the notepad now here you need to scroll down to the bottom and if you find any file any entry here by the name mojang.com 
then you need to delete it and on my end it's one probably on your end it can be more than one or maybe none okay so what if you find it then you need to delete it then close the folder and choose save once done just close it now we can also try resetting the minecraft launcher so on the search box type apps and from the suggestion choose apps and features now here where it says search this list just type here minecraft you will be getting minecraft launcher just click on it and choose advanced options now once you scroll down you will find an option of reset so click on reset and reset again after doing all these steps finally make a restart and launch your minecraft i'm pretty sure that the problem will be fixed and if yes make sure you hit the like and subscribe to the channel and i see you in the next video bye bye